All right, so if you haven't heard about it, this is a DVSN R&B singer. A female came on stage. You know how they, you know how the R&B singers usually sing to them, dance with them, whatever they do, and the women be like, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. That's normal. They've been doing that since the days of Elvis Presley or before that. The thing that is making everybody frustrated on social media about this whole thing is because she was in a relationship. She posted the interaction she had with her boyfriend through text messages on social media and said that he was hating. This is his statement right here. Guess you had a good time shaking your on a dude who was performing. She said, he a hater. Yes, I did. Now, I'm assuming. I'm assuming this is her. This is her dancing on cuz. She's in a full relationship. This is what some of the people had to say. This is the kind of they brag about but cry about not being romanced properly. Now, this is the R&B singer, but obviously this is the guy who made the tweet. He said, this is a woman. N words don't do not want you to enjoy your joy lifetime moments. I'm happy for you. And she says her sister and Okay. Y'all put up with anything. I promise you. My would already know better than to play with me like this. Listen. You don't you never know, bro. You you never know. You really never really know. It's only what they tell you. The only reason that she got exposed because she was on stage. It was on camera. It was all over social media. She couldn't hide it. She did this for the DVSN, like he 1987, Keith Sweat. I ain't never even heard of Keith Sweat. God needs to re-up on the product now. I wouldn't call him a guy, but lowercase g. I, I never even heard of DVSN. Having a fan out shorty is for God's strongest soldiers. Now, I was amazed at what some of the women had to say. It's the disrespectful sharing of her man's feelings via text. Yes, I did. That is sending me. You don't like him, ma'am, just leave. No no woman that loves and respects her man is doing any of these things. And this is a female saying this, right? The only women defending this are the ones who don't see a problem with it because they also lack boundaries and respect for their men. This is trashy behavior and no woman in a relationship should be doing it. I really want to know who raised y'all, like for real. Where's y'all daddies and your uncles at? Your mamas didn't teach y'all about class and being a lady. It baffles me. And before you call me a pick me, the only reason y'all hate accountability is because you're not ready to change. 